Yes, it's, it's the first, the fourth time in a row we are uh, we are here, and the last against, so of course, Chelsea, Arsenal, and Arsenal, Chelsea, Liverpool, uh, we could not do it. And uh, today we perform. Something happened with the microphone. No, I'm just trying to take it away from yours. Sorry. I'm trying to stop that from happening. I think you're okay. Yeah. I think it's this one. Hey. Okay. And. Um, and we cannot, uh, these games, what yesterday I said in the press conference is coming from, from Munich three days ago, and, but we talk about we have to, we have to try it and have to perform well, and they did it in, they did really well. All the guys, they come from the bench, they start, everyone was perfect, everyone involved, and happy, real, real satisfied for all the club to be, after many years, in the FA Cup final. Joe? Of course it is. Always is grumpy with me when he doesn't play all the time. He he make me notice how grumpy he feels. Today no. Uh he's an exceptional player. Playing or playing is exceptional. So the biggest stages player and have mentality to score a goal. The composer for the penalty was important. Uh, finish the first half one zero and after the second and the third were brilliant. So yeah, really good to yeah, to win the final. Really, really good and so satisfied from Riyad because he loves to play football and he has given many, many things in these years and hopefully more in the future. Uh, for the fact that? No concede? No conceded. <coughs> yeah, of course, in this type of games, no concede. They had a clear chance in the first minute. In this type of games and this type of opponents that you cannot press because always long the balls is is to be solid, no consider goal because they defend really well. The crosses they are a master the set pieces, every set pieces is a danger. We struggled in the first half, the first 10, 15 minutes. First half we didn't win not even one second ball. The second half time we adjust some positions, we won the second balls when they play long balls at the end, especially with Maborni. Um but yeah. We we move them well. We lack a little bit to find a little bit more Julian and Erling. They have to move a little bit in behind when the ball go go in the position central positions. But uh, yeah, in general was a yeah good really good performance. Knowing where we come from, especially three days ago where we were, the adrenaline you spend in that games is massive in all in all concepts. And and today for the first minute in the even in the locker room and. Uh, we saw a vibe, okay, okay, the, the guys are here. And, and yeah, you know, th three years in a row, in semifinals, out, out, and out, and to be in the finals is double satisfaction. Going back to Marcus, um, his performance very well in the first half, but then he disappeared. What do you think makes him the right player for decisive games? No, but Riyad, I think, played good in the games, but also in the in the, the people can <laughs> say decisive game. So Riyad loves to play football. He's a big fan of. He's an amateur spirit. Like he's not a guy. I have a contract. I have to do my job. I come here. How many hours I have to train? How many games I have to play? Do my job. I go home. It's completely the opposite. He loves being in contact with the ball, and that's why when he's absent, don't play because he wanna play. I understand completely. But sometimes Bernardo gives us something in the sides that he cannot give us. It's a question of skills, not, not nothing because he cannot do it. Bernardo is, or, or Phil when play, sometimes you need the special things and, and that's why I make a selection. We, we know each other for yeah, many years, so I know I lost the battle to make him understand how important is the group and everything. So yeah, important is when he plays, play in that level. And when that's happened, everything is fine. Mike? No, normally I don't take. A, no, yes, I don't. I don't say who is the taker. When both play, they talk each other, and it's fine. It's okay. As much as much they score, I don't care. We we know for many many years, especially in Champions League, and how many penalties we miss that we drop competition and, and the other ones. Um, Erling missed 
the first one in Munich, but his 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 of course he's is great. And Riyad what one I like the most is the fact he even missed penalties in the past, give me the ball again, give me the ball again. It that define that define the the, the players, I remember Erling after the game in Munich, I asked him, what do you thought when you missed the penalties? He said, I'm going to score next. No next penalty, the next action I'm going to score. And he scored. So that defined the, the top players. They don't live in the past. They don't miss in the, they don't live thinking, oh, I miss, I'm sad. Uh, no, the moment he missed, I said, I'm going to score. I'm going to score. And this is a, the, 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 this type of mentality deserves to play in the big teams. We do not have this type of players, the team cannot be. And it comes for the fabric, it cannot come for the manager said, who will be your thoughts, it come from themselves. That's why when you sign a players to discover these kind of things before the sign is so important. Because at the end make the difference. Seth, I know you said before the game, but you're now in the final of the FA Cup. The title is in your hands. You're in the semi finals of the Champions League. But I also know there's some Manchester United fans who are very scared. They don't have to be scared. We are neighbors, <laughs> <laughs> so the neighbors always are nice each other. So, no. Still, I said yesterday, uh, we are far away, and people cannot believe we are far away about these kind of situations. The travels in this kind of discusses that is okay for the for a funny moment is okay, but the reality is completely different. Realities come here and perform. I, I I said many times and repeat again. The most impressed I have for this club, start for the hierarchy until the last person in the backroom staff, is after many, many years, I would say six, seven years, I would say six years, winning titles and titles and titles. And when you lose the titles, you lose in the last stages and final Champions League or semifinals or, or FA Cup semifinals at times, still we are there one more year. And this is what I'm proud the most as a manager of and that's why I like to be here and I love to work with this club for many reasons for that reason. Because one year you can do. But I don't want to win a Champions League and after the next three years you are in the bottom or not fighting for you have to fight. That is not. So Champions League destroy projects most of the times when you win or when you lose. And this club is quite a stable in, in that terms. Of course, I'm here sitting because we won the Premier League, they won titles, otherwise we'll be another manager. I'm not a stupid in that. But in the same times, I know that they analyze what is the situation in the team, what we need, what we are, what we are doing, um, not come just for a specific results. That's why after six years, we are in the last stages, the last six weeks or seven weeks left, and still we are fighting for the titles. Okay, so we lose the, the Carabao Cup, but still we are here to lose the titles, the biggest ones, and and this is the most important trophy that we can we can get. Thank you so much, of course, for the people I said to the the guys. So the last three years, the worst performance we have done in the season is FA Cup semi-finals. The worst. We were not here. So and today, travel a lot, a lot of play people from Man from Manchester, like they don't have the privilege that we have. At least we have to perform well, guys. At least that perform who we are. I'm not talking about winning or losing, perform who we are. And in the first minute, in the locker room, in the warm-up and everything, the team was there, and that's why we could win. Guys, I've got one more before the embargo, just here, please. Can you ask you for your thoughts on Sheffield United's performance today, and how important was that penalty? Yeah, it was really important. Today is, is a final, and these decisive situations are, are key. In this type of games, many things would happen if the first action that they had a score goal. And they defend well, we start to play anxious and they make another transition and then you can lose a game. So that's why be stable in those situations and Stefan make another exceptional game. Um, many players that don't play in regularly help us a lot to, to make a really good game, like Sergio was and many of them. So, and, and yeah. So this Sheffield is not mathematically, but it's already a team of the Premier League next season. So that means that means it's a, a good team.